uh, Chief of the Capitol Police to come in today and talk about their short-term uh, response to the overwhelming hours that officers have been working. We're about 200 officers below the authorized level of around 2,000 officers. 135 or so officers retired last year, which is about 50 percent higher than retirements in recent years. And uh, obviously that's a problem. The contract employees for a short time may be part of the answer to that problem. <clears throat> Uh, but it's not just a problem in the, the Capitol Police Department. You know, in the city of St. Louis and St. Louis County, uh, they had uh, retirements were up about 60% last year over the average of the previous four years. My hometown, Springfield, Missouri, is looking for 40 officers. Columbia, Missouri, a department 187, looking for 20 officers. We're going to do what we can here to work with the Capitol Police problem. But I think this problem is clearly a lot bigger than the Capitol Police, starting with defund the police and prosecutors who pledge not to prosecute uh, crimes in certain areas or uh, at certain crimes. All has, and uh, the police officers being becoming the increasing victims of crime is a huge problem. Uh, all of us see the Capitol Police every day, know how critically they are to our ability to function here uh, it's a problem all over the country. Uh, we're doing our best to try to think of new ways to solve that problem.